Story title. My uncle's dog is completely different. Author name. Mr. Stuffed Baconator. A few years ago, I went to my home country of Brazil, and I got to see my uncle's dog for the first time. It was a white Samoyed-esque dog, with white fur and pointy ears. His name is Sebastian, and I even took a picture on my phone of him. So flash forward to last year, my family decided to live in Brazil. We arrive at the airport and my uncle picks us up in his van. During the ride to the city we'll be living in, we start discussing some stuff and I ask how Sebastian is doing. My uncle says he's doing well or whatever and I ask if I can see him again. We arrive at his house where we see his wife and I say hello, but standing right next to her was this huge Labrador. I thought it was weird how they would get two dogs and not mention it. I ask my aunt what his name is. And she says, what are you talking about? This is Sebastian. I stood there for a second and just thought back. It's one thing to forget what color a dog is, but to forget what breed it was entirely seems unlikely. I played it off and pet him for a bit. As soon as I could, I checked my mom's phone to find the picture I took of him and me. And lo and behold, the dog in the picture was a Labrador. This is the weirdest thing to ever happen to me. Does anyone know what could have happened? Personal thoughts. Okay, so this is fascinating. There seems to be an influx of stories related to memory shifts lately. There was another one maybe a couple weeks ago. Uh, a person whose job it is to maintain properties and condos. He visits one, takes a picture because the layout is different, he goes to wash his face and then he comes back out and everything is back to how it should be, including the picture. Your situation is so similar. It's a memory, although it is more long term. My guess in his case was probably the same as yours. Somehow you have the ability to witness alternate universes for a brief moment. Or perhaps there's a trigger we're yet unaware of that can cause these visions without an actual crossover event. Did you notice anything out of place when you first saw the dog as a Samoyed? Hmm. If not, I have no ideas. But at least it's not a painful memory. Second story. Story title. What just happened? Am I going mad? Author name. I have no willy. I just left work literally not 10 minutes ago and the strangest thing just happened. So I work in a Dublin airport, and the time is now 1.07 AM. As I'm leaving after the last flight has just left the airport, I'm walking out through the terminal building, which is completely empty now, all shops closed, and nobody is around. As I am leaving, I see one of the cleaners walking out from a corridor to my left, and I give the usual, good night now, to anyone I see on my way out, and he does the same back and walks the one-way system down in the opposite direction. Now here's where it gets weird. I walk a little more from Terminal 1 to Terminal 2, which is about a 15 minute walk, in order to get out to the level of the car park. And as I'm walking towards the last door, before I get out to the passenger area door to my left, it opens and out comes the exact same cleaner I saw literally 15 minutes ago. Down to the small Irish flag pin he was wearing on the lanyard of his ID, and he looks at me and says, Good night now. And I looked at him and asked, How did you get from one side of the terminal to here so fast before me? Jokingly. He looked at me like I had two heads and said, Mate, I've been cleaning the storage room for the last hour. Seriously, what just happened? This was the exact same person, same height, same grey slightly balding hair, same Irish flag pin on the ID lanyard. The way I came is the only way to get to the exit I was leaving through, as it's a one-way system with multiple ID locks you need to get through to access it. Personal Thoughts So the first thing that pops into my mind is another memory shift. But on reflection this really doesn't make sense, 
because nothing actually changed. It was just the location. The person was the same. Hmm, so maybe some sort of ghost? Did you physically interact with him in any way? If not, then you could try confirming who he is at your job. Perhaps you can look up IDs from all cleaners working in a terminal area you walk through. It's quite possible you could find him. If he's not an ethereal being, then it strikes me as a sort of foresight ability that you have. Has this ever, has anything like this ever happened to you before? And for all the listeners, let me know too in the comments if anything similar has happened to you. Personally, I've never predicted the future. I know a lot of people have this sort of ability, but it usually comes to them in dreams, not manifested in reality as illusions. And as always, if you enjoyed this narration, show it some love.